these runs, they just, it is a lot. You gotta go so far. Oh my, that's very action-y. That's called, I'm doing a moonshine run. This is more of a bank robbery tune. <laughs> Standing on the road down here. Uh, are you right? Hello? Sir? Oh, hey. Oh, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, I've got. Hands so, up. I've off got the horse. <laughs> off the horse. I've got. I'm getting off the horse, please. You don't need to. Step away from the horse. I'm stepping away. Is he all right though? He's just standing there. Come on. What's your name? Panther. What the hell is happening? Please, you, are you taking everything that I've got? Please don't do that. No, I won't take everything. You're taking both my weapons. I need those. Why is this happening right here? I was... I was a pastel standing from the blood lost. Please, no, can you... Can, you're taking both my customized weapons? Do you realize how hard I worked for that? about you, sir? What you got? I, I, the bear pelt is probably the most valuable thing I have. I, I can put it onto your horse if you'd like. Well, I don't think they'd take both my weapons. Yeah, I really, really thought they would only take oh, one. Nice day. I'm sorry. That's not your fault. I just thought you need, looked like you needed help. <sighs> you have a horse nearby? I, I, I do. I'm here. I, heard, uh, I know this isn't going to make up for your lost guns or anything, but take this. It was only one shot or one, one axe, so it might be worth something. Sorry, I'm going to go and send a letter to the deputies. Yeah. I really like that volcanic. I might get them back, though. Because they do have my name and telegram on them both. I just hope they don't take them and melt them down, you know? Yeah, I try not to do that, or I'd, I'd have only taken one. Personally, if I found someone with 40 bucks and two custom weapons, I would have taken the... I would have taken just the money, unless they were really, like, rude to me. He might have been in on it. I should have asked him his name. I'm stupid. Oh, well. Nope, Saffron would not go for revenge. Hey, got a little job for you. 
I'll probably, uh, I'll try and find deputies, and I'll let them know in person. Uh, then I'll go back to the gun store and ask him to keep an eye out. Tell him that I don't care who did it, I just like the weapons back. So... Yeah, I think, I feel like he was having technical issues. I mean, I kind of, okay, when I saw it, I kind of had a feeling I might get robbed there. <sighs> but I stopped anyways. Because it's, you know, I mean, I applaud the, you know, people doing a roadside robbery like that. I He must, he probably almost for certain was in on it. deer. Whoops, I killed the freaky deer. Well, hello. Ah, Maverick, thank you for the follow. That well, hello, it scares me. Yeah, I saw them coming. I could have run at that point, but again, I just, I don't like to do that to people. I, I didn't think they would just go and take all my guns. whoop de doo a cattleman. Yeah, and he'll judge me so hard. Yeah, now Jody will rob me and, and he'll see that I just have a cattleman and he'll judge me really hard. Well, you're sort of turning right in the way, sir. Whoops. My horse lost his uh, pelt too. It's not on him anymore. He must have wiped out or something. Uh, you know what I'll probably do is I'll probably telegram Olivia. Because she did get me back uh, my Lancaster. Ugh, I can't believe they take both. And just a quick stick up, fully masked and everything. Like, ah, oh, come on, guys, really? Hunter for coal is good money. Yeah, it just takes a long time to do. It's uh, honestly doing the orange runs are a lot faster. Because first you have to go get the coal, which takes a long time. Uh, I was just want to see if I could get more diamonds while I was doing it, really. Uh, it takes a really long time to get the coal. And that's way on the other side of the state. And they have to go complete opposite side of the state to go to Annisburg to send it. And then it's a really long route. Anyone there? Someone at the door. I sorry. Ma'am, I. Can I help you? Uh, I just got robbed, so I wanted to report in person. I did send a telegram. To oh an yeah, we were about to come up to Annisburg. I'm glad you came here before we left. Come on in. Uh, sure. Go ahead and have a seat. Uh, sure. Don't mind the paper boy, he's just dropping off papers. I was gonna go down to Rhodes and get an estimate on the value of what's lost because that was a lot. So. And I'm afraid that I can't give you too much information because. You know, they were completely masked up and everything, you know, can't even give you a hair colour. Alright, and what's your full name? We'll start there. Uh, Saffron Mitchell. That's two F's, two L's. Alright. And <clears throat> let's start from the top and tell me what you can give me. Right, well, I was riding at Annisburg and 
just before I got into town, you know, usually where there's cougars prowling around, I saw a fella standing there in the middle of the road with a bear pelt on his shoulder and I worried that he might be in trouble because he didn't have a horse near him or anything. So I stopped and I asked him and he didn't speak to me at all. He didn't respond. And then at the corner of my eye, I see someone come running down the slope with a shotgun in their hand. And um, she had a cougar sort of mask on her head and a bandana around her face and was wearing one of those double uh, double fronted black leather coats that goes down to the knee with the double row of buttons and a wee bit of fur lining. Okay, slow down. She had a cougar. I'm writing all this as you. Aye, like a panther, she, a, a panther mask. Cougar a mask on a head aye. with a bandana. My dark grey bandana, one of those ones that maybe looks like sort of a school sort of face on it, but not quite. It was only covering half her face. All right, and what kind of coat? Uh it was it was black leather with two rows of buttons down the front, and furred on the inside. All right. Um, and what happened after that? Uh, she said, hands up. She took both my Lancaster, my customized, fully customized Lancaster and my fully customized Volcanic and $40, the $40 that was in my pocket. Both weapons were etched. Yeah. Um, I want you to start with the Lancaster and tell me what customizations it had on it. Uh, all right. It had a nickel, um, nickel frame and it was um, engraved and inlaid with still blue and then the lever the trigger and the hammer were all um gold is that mcgregor yeah he's, he's out there in the moment all right okay um and what was it etched uh etched with did it have a name anything i uh property of s mitchell MS716. So it's got my name and have Grim on it. Alright, and your volcanic pistol. Uh, go ahead and tell me what it's like. Uh, it was fully black and it was engraved on the frame. Also black engraving. And then um, the liver, trigger, and hammer were all silver. And the grip was pearl. Did it say the same thing? I same same etching. When I when I exclaimed, "You're gonna take both my customized weapons from me and my money," she uh, shoved a cavalman in my pocket. So, no, oh, lovely. Mm -hmm. All right, McGregor, our Annisburg came to us. <laughs> I, I see that. Well, I'm sure that she fled quite way. I watched her trying to run up the slope and slipping and sliding down her face several times. Uh, she was carrying a um, repeating shotgun. That's what she was threatening me with. I think, I think it might have been customized. It might have been dark, like the metals might have been dark. Mm. Okay. And she didn't have any sort of discernible accent, it was American accent, about it. Just ran in for no reason, excuse me. Sometimes those doors can be a bother. Yeah, yeah, sure can. Hey, Teddy Bear. <sighs> Who's this fella? Who's this fella? Deputy Vespucci gave me that, gave me that volcanic after my last weapons robbed off me. McGregor, you don't know Teddy Lynch? <laughs> All right, let me just read this to you to make sure I've gotten everything. Um, before you got into Annisburg, you saw a man in the middle of the road with a bear pelt. Um, you stopped to talk to him. Someone came running down the slope with a shotgun. She had on a cougar mask with a dark gray bandana, black leather coat with two oh, rows of buttons and fur on the inside. Um, she told you to put her hands up. Um, she took both of your fully customized Lancaster, fully customized Volcanic, and $40. Right. All right, and when you complained about her taking both guns and $40, uh, she put a cattleman revolver in your pocket. Aye. Oh, yeah, that's nice. I didn't know we had those. All right, so she had no discernible accent or anything like that, you said? I just American. I think she was white. I could just see it around her eyes. 
All right. And do you think the man was with her? Like, he was there as bait, or...? You know, he might have been, but it was odd because he wasn't speaking, and then he seemed, like, to sort of be in a daze, and then be shocked. But, again, he didn't have a horse around him, and it was very odd. Uh, he was wearing a bowler hat. That's the most I remember of him. I should have asked his name. Oh, the woman, right. the woman called herself, quote-unquote, the panther, when I asked her how she was. I'm sure it's, you know... I mean, whatever. Yeah, all right. Well, Saffron, the good thing is your weapons, if we retrieve them, are very recognizable and you will get them back if we I, get them. Unless she just um, takes them and melts them down, eh? Yeah, um, which that's what we don't hope happens. Uh, what's your telegram number in case we do retrieve these weapons? It's MS716. Uh, Never mind, it's on your damn guns. <laughs> Aye. All right. <laughs> Sorry, That's it's why just, it's on my guns. <laughs> it's just a habit for me to ask for everybody's telegram number. All right. Um, is there anything else you want to tell me? Uh, no. I... All right. Well, um, if you think of anything else, put in an anon. Come see me, um, or anybody, and we'll update the report. Sure. Okay. I'm gonna go down to the gun store and get an estimate on the value of all that. If you um, could do that, that would be fantastic. I... And then uh, I'll be out on the porch, and you can come and tell me. All right, thank you. Uh huh. I appreciate it. Very sorry this has happened to you. I saw my. I really you thought that she'd have the courtesy room. to not take yeah, but everything that I owned. Everything. But, well, yeah. I gotta talk to my associate behind me, and then we'll figure it out. All right. You want me to wait around for a little bit? Uh, you can wait for a few minutes. Eh? All right, stolen guns. I know you came across my glitch field before. If you see any fully customized Lancaster and volcanic bearing my name and telegram, well, I'd be willing to pay something at least, and would very much appreciate it. I don't need to know where they came from. Just would love to be able to get my things back if at all possible. Thank you so much, Saffron. I really like that volcanic. I love that volcanic. Like I really like that volcanic. I hope I get the volcanic back. 